हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल दिस इज ओलंपियाड मैथ्स फॉर क्लास सिक्स पार्ट टू सम मोर क्वेश्चंस फ्रॉम ओलंपियाड टेस्ट पेपर 2017 व्हाट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ पी प्लस क्यू इन द गिवन नंबर लाइन सो इन अ नंबर लाइन ऑन द राइट साइड ऑफ जीरो द वैल्यूज आर ऑलवेज पॉजिटिव एंड ऑन द लेफ्ट साइड ऑफ जीरो द वैल्यूज आर नेगेटिव Now, as shown in the number line, Q equals to three. As there are five points at equal distance on the right side of zero, and value of fifth point is fifteen. So the difference between the points on the right side of zero is plus three. That is, as we go right on the number line, the value at each point will be increased by plus three. Similarly. P equals to minus nine, as difference between the points on the left side of zero is minus three. That is, as we go left on the number line, the value at each point will be decreased by minus three. Now, P plus Q equals to minus nine plus three equals to minus six. So, correct option is B. The age of two persons differ by 16 years. If six years ago the elder one be three times as old as the younger one, find their present age. Now let the present age of the two persons be x and y. The age of these two persons differ by 16 years. So X minus y equals to 16, or x equals to 16 plus y. This is our equation one. Now six years ago, the elder one be three times as old as the younger one. So six years back, their age would be x minus six and y minus six. So x minus six equals to 3 times y minus 6 now substituting the value of x from equation 1 in equation 2 we have 16 plus y that is the value of x minus 6 equals to 3 times y minus 6 or 10 plus y equals to 3y minus 18 Or 3y minus y equals to 10 plus 18, or 2y equals to 28, or y equals to 12. Now substituting the value of y in equation one, we have x equals to 16 plus 12 equals to 28. So correct option is A. A rectangular field is to be fenced on three sides, leaving a side of 20 feet uncovered. If the area of the field is 680 square feet, how many feet of fencing will be required? Now see the picture. The red boundary line around the rectangular field need to be fenced, leaving a side of 20 feet uncovered. Now, area of the field is 680 square feet, and one side that is uncovered is 20 feet. That is the width of the rectangular field. Now, area of rectangular field equals to length into width. So, 680 equals to l length of the field into 20 width of the field. Or L equals to 680 divided by 20 equals to 34 feet. Now fencing required is equals to AB plus BC plus CD. So opposite sides of rectangle are equal. So AB is equals to CD equals to 34 and BC equals to AD equals to 20. Now substituting this value. In the equation, we have 
88 feet of fencing is required. Correct option is A. In a party room, 20 workers will decorate 70 tables. Each table will be decorated with 10 silver balloons and 15 gold balloons. Which equation could be used to find X, the total number of silver and gold balloons needed to decorate all the tables. Now each table will be decorated with 10 silver balloons and 15 gold balloons. So total number of silver and gold balloons used for one table is 10 plus 15. Now 20 workers decorate 70 tables. So total number of silver and gold balloons used for 70 tables equals to 70 times 10 plus 15. Now if x is the total number of silver and gold balloons, x equals to 70 into 10 plus 15. So correct option is A. Find the average of all the numbers between 6 and 34 which are divisible by 5. Now first we will find the numbers between 6 and 34 which are divisible by 5. So we will choose the multiples of 5 between 6 and 34. So the numbers are 10, 15, 20, 25 and 30. Now average of these numbers is 10 plus 15 plus 20 plus 25 plus 30 divided by 5 equals to 100 divided by 5 equals to 20. This is the formula to calculate the average sum of all the numbers divided by total number of numbers. Now correct option is B. If A into B equals to 2A minus 3B plus AB, then find the value of 3 into 5 plus 5 into 3. Now A into B is 2A minus 3B plus AB is equation number 1. Now 3 into 5 equals to put A equals to 3 and B equals to 5 in equation 1. We have 2A is 2 into 3 minus 3b is 3 into 5 plus ab is 3 into 5 so 6 minus 15 plus 15 equals to 6 plus 0 equals to 6 now 5 into 3 equals to put a equals to 5 and b equals to 3 in equation 1 we have 2a is 2 into 5 minus 3b is 3 into 3 plus ab is 5 into 3 or 10 minus 9 plus 15 equals to 25 minus 9 equals to 16. Now 3 into 5 plus 5 into 3 equals to 6 plus 16 equals to 22. So correct option is C. Thanks for watching. If the video is useful, please like, share and subscribe.